me ask you something about the Bible, because you said this is the word of God that you believe in, right? You know uh, why I think it's your, the word of God? Oh, 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 trying to run, trying to run. Is that what it is? No, do, do I hear, I'm going to be here all day. Tap, 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 tap. All right, well, I'm not going to be here all day, but I got things to do. So, all right, Exodus. No, you don't. You're a Exodus. scholar debating Zerka. <laughs> He has thing. to get more dollar to convert more There's people. Color debating Zerka. You got nowhere to go. Who, who's Zerka? I didn't, I didn't even tell. He doesn't know who you are. He's here to talk to me. <laughs> we're here, we're here to have Zerga? a conversation. You don't have nowhere to go. You have nowhere to go. Who, who's Zerka? That's, Zerka. That's Zerka. my point. That's my point. You're a scholar on a call with Zerka. <laughs> look, look let, me, let me explain something. I'm a student of knowledge, and this is my brother, Sneeko. And alhamdulillah, we had a conversation. And alhamdulillah, we had a threesome and I, the other and, day. Are you going to yell at him? Th th look, 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 look. In Islam, we don't try to expose people's sins. Whatever somebody does, that's between them and God. Yeah, but Sneeko goes around telling me to repent. Look, he tweets look, at me, look. says, Zerka, you got to repent. He, what he's saying is true, and you should repent. And really? just trying but to call him out. He had sex with that, two non Muslim that, women that, at that, that same that, damn that, time. Look, he's look, had look, sex. Look. If, if that's true, that's between him and God, and he should repent. But that doesn't make it okay for you to do your sins. Don't throw it on him. So why no, is he telling you to repent wanna, as he's uh, having uh, sexual intercourse? All right, all right. You good, publicize good. it. You, you, I'll, you, I'll respond good, good. because Zerka publicizes it and he, make his, he makes it his image. He'll say that I'm a Christian, but I'm not a Christian. I'm a Christian defender. I do coke and I sleep with uh, prostitutes, stuff like this. But also I'm a Christian <laughs> defender. You call yourself evil. You call yourself evil by entering this call. Wait, what did I say? Zerka, I'm listen, with listen, listen, listen. Listen, listen, you, you, yes, if you want to discuss Nico's personal life, talk to him offline. I'm here to discuss scripture is with Nico you. Is Nico a good Muslim? And now, uh, I, I hope that everybody's a good Muslim that's Muslim. I judge that's, people. That's a political I answer. I, I don't, that's not a political answer. That's an Islamic answer. In Islam, we don't assume bad about people. What I see, there is a difference. What I see from Nico is he's Muslim. I assume good about him. What his personal life is, I don't Bro. dig into that's Every YouTuber who is a now, Muslim is listen, like listen, listen. very degen. De uh, look, I'm on YouTube and I'm not a degenerate, alhamdulillah. So, Exodus, now, because this is what you run from. Exodus 21, 20. And if a man beats his male or female servant with a rod so that he dies under his hand, he shall surely be punished. Notwithstanding, if he re remains alive a day or two, he shall not be punished for he is his property. This is oh, your word of God. Days? And if, if he saves a life for a day from that beating, then there's no punishment because that man is another man's property. Yes. If a, if a man owns a slave, male or female, and beats him with a rod so bad that they mm -hmm. die a day later, there's no punishment in the Bible. Now, you, you believe this to be the word of God? Absolutely. Wow. Yeah. Now I well, got, I got a question. That's Christianity uh, for you. Then, now? <laughs> moderator, moderator, yeah, go, go for it, go for it. Bro. You know how you, need a moderator. Uh, they, you know how in the Quran Allah has all these other names. Why is one of yeah. the names the deceiver? There is no name deceiver. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> what What's the name in Arabic? Deceiver. Well, uh, I'll, name deceiver. I'll have it? to post it on Twitter and tag you today. I'll go no, for no, it. Don't 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 post. You know Twitter. what I'm talking I'm about right. or no? I'm, I, I, I do know never heard that about. before that, that, ever in your life. There is no name of Allah that means the deceiver. You so you've never Allah's heard this argument? Look, bro. I, I look. have a feeling you've heard this before. Listen, you want to hear? I'm going to speak, right? Allah's names, like Ar Rahman, Ar Rahim, the most merciful, the extremely merciful, Al Wudud, the most loving, those are the names called Asma al Husna. What you're re referring to is a verse in the Quran that talks about matter. And this, the earliest scholars, the clear Quran's explanation explains the meaning here is plot. The kuffar, they made their plans and plotted, and Allah had his plans, and he is the best of planners. And that's why if you get any standard English translation, whether it's Sahih International, whether it's Pixar, whether it's, uh, you know, you can go to Muhsin Khan or uh, Mustafa Khattab or any of those, you will find that this verse here means to plan. You don't know Arabic, I'm assuming. You don't know the names of Allah, I'm assuming. Oh, you just heard some Islamophobe say something somewhere without any references, you're just trying to throw it out. Now, you believe that God ordered that if you beat a slave so bad that they just live a day, there is no punishment because that's their property, that's what you believe? I mean, it's in the Bible, right? 
So that, that's what you like, believe 100%, you, huh? Like in your Quran, it says the sun sets in a muddy puddle. You believe that, It right? does not. Once oh, again, really? that's wrong. Or the, yeah, bro, you don't, you're a flat you, earther. You have to be a flat earther. Cause, I am not a flat earther. But it says the earth is spread flat like a carpet. I already explained that earlier with the Sneeko. Really? The Why don't you explain it, it right now? Explain it right now. I got you, bro. Or did I'll I get the Arabic right wrong? You did, but that's okay too. No, the right? Quran is correct. It is flat. That. It is flat. You want me to answer, bro, or no? Yeah, I want to know the flat one. I got you on all of them. Look, there's nothing you're bringing up that's new here, other than a little bit of your ignorance, but that's all right. Right? So, now, when you talk about the muddy water, this is Dhul Qarnayn, who said he saw the sun setting in the muddy water. That is not that it's set. That's his sight. For example, if I go to the Pacific Ocean, like you're in LA, go outside, and you see the sun setting into the ocean, it doesn't mean the sun goes in the ocean. That's describing what you see. Okay. All right? that's, that's, that's the first misconception. That's, that's fair. I appreciate your fairness. All right, good, man. All right. Secondly, Al-Ardu Mi'ada, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says he spread out the earth. Not that it's flat or round as a, as a body, but rather Allah made it flat so you can farm, so you can use it, you can utilize it. No, no, no. In Arabic, mean... the word is bed, but it, beds were carpets back then. Like that, they'd sleep on very yeah. thin. So no, the no, word no, was no, no. flat listen, like a listen. bed. What, what's the Arabic word? I don't know. Yeah, I did don't this. Know. I did this debate two <laughs> years ago. I did this debate uh, two you. years ago. I you expect you. me to remember you. this debate from listen, two years ago? Listen. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. Relax. Go get the Tafsir Ibn Kathir. It's in English. If you oh. don't know Arabic, so, and so, I, so and it explains I bring, the word any, and everything. Anytime I bring up an English translation, you'll say, "Actually, you got the word wrong. Actually, you got the word wrong. Actually, you, you got you the did. word. You don't know Arabic. Bro, you got the word you, wrong. That's all you guys look, ever do, bro. If you if you get the word wrong, what can I do? You're ignorant, bro. So all is right. the word flat the, in the, there? The store, is the word flat no. in there? Oh has it spread out. You don't know, then you don't know. Spread bro. out. It's spread out. Yes, yeah, go spread out a sphere. Let me explain it, right? The earth, for example, if it was all mountainous, we couldn't farm. We couldn't utilize it. Allah made the earth spread out so you can farm, you can utilize the land. Do you understand? 